After being awarded a super cool cape by River for his service to the kingdom, Marco goes home, and Star doesn't go with him. It seems as if her time on Earth really is over. The show wasn't just telling us that to create a suspenseful cliffhanger at the end of season two. She really is back on Muni for good. They have a bit of an awkward goodbye that was genuinely cute. Star's parents seem to think so as well. But it's quite obvious as soon as Marco is gone that Star is missing him greatly. In fact, she even kept one of his hoodies, going so far as to tell him that she didn't know where it was. Because it's gross and dirty and it smells like him. Those are, however, all great reasons for Ponyhead to throw it down the laundry chute, leading to a long and visually interesting chase sequence, where Star tries to recover the hoodie from the current Knight of the Wash, whose name I didn't catch, before he can wash the scent away. However, she does realize that she's only hanging onto the hoodie because she misses Marco and that she needs to move on. She allows him to wash the hoodie. Star comes to the realization that her memories of Marco are enough. She returns the hoodie to him. End of episode. And... This wasn't a bad episode. I want to preface the rest of this review with that. I did enjoy this episode. It was a good episode. It was well done. It was visually interesting, like I said. There was some excellent humor in here from Ponyhead, which is a phrase I never thought I would say, at which I laughed out loud several times. And it had a good message that even though the pain isn't magically going to go away, you need to start moving on. You need to let things go and get on with your life. That's important. I just don't feel like that needed its own episode. I feel like that could have been a theme over several episodes, kind of hanging out in the background as other stuff was going on. But Ponyhead was good in this episode. The message was a good message. The Knight of the Wash was an interesting character. And this did serve as a good denouement to the Battle for Muni special, so I can't really complain. I may not feel that this episode was 100% necessary, but I still liked it. And at the end of the day, that's all that matters. As per usual, though, guys, I'd like to know if you have seen this episode, Send of a Hoodie. What did you think of it? Let's get a discussion going in the comments section down below or over on my Discord. Link in the description. Either way, this has been AJ22, and I will talk to you guys later.